Welcome back to a new tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how I create this felt material for my characters. First I made this character, but now I want to add some hair to it. I've got a reference image of the character I want to make. I want to create this felt like looking hair. I first model these objects which got the shape of the hair. Now let's work on the hair. For that we can go to the particle properties and add a new particle system. Change the type to hair. Set the length to 0.1 and add interpolated children's. You can increase the display amount to 80 and the render amount to 100. Go down to the roughness and set the uniform to 0.05. Change the endpoint to 0.1 and the random also to 0.1. Now your hair is looking not so uniform and a bit rougher, but we want these curls as you can see in the felt. For that we can just set the kink type to curl. Now you got some really curly hair, but we want to have it a bit more subtle. For that change the amplitude to 0.05. Now we got these curly hairs, but each individual strands are a bit too thick for what I want, so we can change the diameter root to 0.2. Now the hair is looking pretty good but it is looking a bit too perfect. We want some smaller hairs which are sticking out of the side and making it look a bit more like a soft and handmade material. For that we can just add another particle system, change it to hair again and maybe lower the amount to 800, decrease the hair length to 0.18, add interpolated children's again and maybe lower the render amount to 20 so we can get some longer but not so many hairs change the uniform to 0.18 and the end point to 0.15 also increase the random to 0.05 for the kink i found that wave is working the best for these longer but outsticking hairs but lower the amplitude to something really low like 0.02 as you can see the hair is looking a bit more natural and a bit rougher but again we can see that the hairs are really thick i want these out sticking hairs to be really thin so they just catch a bit of light for that we can change the diameter root to 0.1 there you go we have got a really nice felt like looking hair material with some smaller hairs on the sides i think our felt material is looking pretty realistic we got this thick curly hairs and also some outsticking hairs on the sides. Now I'm just gonna add this to the top hair too and there you go. Now we've got really nice felt like looking hair but I also want to add some color to it. I really like the blue color in this handmade figure. For that you can just use the principal BSDF shader, add a color ramp and a noise texture, plug the color into the factor and the color into the base color, change the the scale to maybe 20 and the roughness to 1. Decide on the hair color you like. I found that this blue color complemented really nicely with the skin and also the, with the cloth of my character. But make sure that you change one color to a darker shade of your color and one to a brighter shade. With that you can add more randomness to the color of the hair which overall makes it a bit more natural and a bit more random. If you decide to use this hair on your own projects, maybe consider tagging me on Instagram. I would love to see what you guys are gonna create. I hope you found this video interesting and helpful and have a nice day.